Mark Smith, I, I'm the co-lead on the IBC Accelerator Programme, but also the chair of the IBC Council. Well, it's a, an extraordinary event, actually, that brings together what we call champions, who are the buyers of technology that come to IBC. Uh, they set out their pitches, which are challenges, um, issues, problems they want to solve, things that keep them awake at night, and things that are common across the industry that they want to try and address. And then we have participants who are the vendors, the solution providers, systems integrators, software developers that come to actually then get involved in the projects to solve those challenges. You can hear the buzz in the room. I, you know, it is an extraordinary event that brings together the ecosystem, the technology ecosystem behind IBC. We're trying to address problems that no one organization can solve by themselves. You know, a BBC cannot solve many of these things, as big as they are, important as they are. Um, we have to find solutions that work across the industry on a global basis. And that's, I think, one of the, definitely one of the things that is, is really key here. But also, these are really complica complicated um, parts of a puzzle. And that puzzle is digital transformation at a big level. And each part of the puzzle is all different elements that I think um, is moving the game from a world of sort of traditional broadcasting to a world of online and IP and software and cloud and all of those things. I, I think IBC is really, really important and never more so, right? Because it brings together, it convenes the industry. It's by the industry, for the industry. And it provides a platform for the industry to talk about how we solve some of these things, how we work together. And then, you know, how do we address um, some of these issues of transformation? But with, with the audience in mind, right? It's not about technology for technology's sake. It's not about the next big thing. It's about what our audience is expecting, demanding, what do they need? You know, and there's lots of great examples of um, actually thinking backwards from the audience, thinking back about what they need in the pitches that, were, 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 were to, that happened today. Clearly, AI, absolutely, gen AI, uh, analytical AI, predictive AI, in all its forms. I, I think what this industry is looking for there, though, is some very, very specific use cases. It's a tool, right? It's not a complete holistic solution. It's a tool that can be applied to many, many different things. I think connectivity is going to be a big thing, too, continuing to be a big thing. Uh, we've seen 5G and, and, and what that can do for the industry in the context of private networks. I think now all IP sort of cloud-based workflows as we go forward, connectivity is going to be critical, right, to, to powering the future for the industry. Um, other than that, I think it's going to be more and more immersive tech, more and more sort of uh, virtualized production, remote production, these are the key trends. So today, here in London, at the Institute of Engineering and Technology, it's the IBC Accelerator Programme Kickstart Day. This is where it all begins in terms of the development of projects that will be really focused on finding some great solutions to common challenges faced by the industry.